welcome back to my channel it is Rona Cole here and yes I am doing an official intro okay so if you can see my kitchen behind me it is an absolute mess but it has to be clean tonight I cannot take it anymore it is 10 29 p.m. and we are going to get this done tonight if you have not already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Also, turn on those notification bells so you are notified every time I post a video. So, okay, let me prepare myself. Let's do this. So this is an overview of how my kitchen looked before I cleaned it. So first I'm gonna get started on the dishes. I had so many large pieces to wash. You are going to see me trying to force things into the dishwasher that did not fit. I was like not trying to hand wash all of these dishes, but I had to anyway. So this clean with me was filmed after Labor Day. We had had a cookout and my husband's mom and stepdad were in town. So there was a lot of large plastic wear and cookware to be washed and cleaned. No, I am a done snob. I will not use anything else. I love done so much. So because some of these pieces were very greasy, I decided to add some baking soda to the water. Been thinking about you all night. I've been searching for this all my life. You're just my type. I've been looking for a boy who can treat me right. Your dark hair with those eyes so bright. They look into my soul and it sparks my life. Can I take you there? Take you there. Like it was the first time. Do you remember? Can I take you there?
first time, do you remember? Can I take you there? Back to when we felt like this was forever. Can I take you there? I decided to save my cast iron skillet for last since I had put that baking soda in the water. I didn't want it to strip it of the oil and rust it out. Trust me, I have made that mistake before and I had to go in and clean all the rust out of the skillet and re-season it. It was not fun. just way too quiet in my kitchen so of course I had to turn on some music So there was some stuck on food on the countertop so I just put my towel in the microwave for a couple of seconds to make it really hot and then I just placed it on top of the stuck on food so it could wipe cleanly off.
had a lot of crumbs on it from us cooking and baking and stuff like that so I just wanted to wipe it off first before I put any cleaner on it so I am of course using my DIY vinegar cleaner to clean the microwave and countertops and I am using awesome to spray down the stove I still haven't found my go-to cleaning product for my glass top stove. I just keep trying things, but nothing that I'm in love with. God, I had cut the alarm on and as soon as I opened that door like the warning beep started going off oh my god it was a mess <laughs> it was such a mess I was trying to put in the cold the cold would not work the keypad started going crazy I was running around trying to find my keys it was yeah so after I gathered myself back together my husband called to make sure everything was okay I just continued cleaning If you guys like to bake, leave a comment down below. I tried my first ever pound cake from scratch the other day and it came out so good. I think I'm gonna start trying new recipes every week. The bulk of the cleaning was really just clearing off the countertops and putting everything back where it was supposed to be. I don't know how I let this kitchen get this bad, but yeah, it was ridiculous.
walking around on this towel was wearing my feet and ankles out so your girl had to go ahead and put on some slides to finish the job I can't get you out of my mind It's like I feel it for the first time Been thinking about you all night I've been searching for this all my life You're just my type I've been looking for a boy who can treat me right your dark hair with those eyes so bright They look into my soul and it sparks my life Can I take you there? Like it was the first time, do you remember? Can I take you there? Back to when we felt like this was forever Can I take you there? chairs have been treated with scotch guard but they are still kind of stained from of course the kids eating so i went ahead and cleaned them with that vinegar cleaner and they came out great the scotch guard makes it so easy to clean upholstery i spray it on my couch my chairs even in my car the car seat anything that is fabric i use the scotch guard it makes it so easy to wipe it and just go like it was the first time, do you remember? Can I take you there? Back to when we felt like this was forever. Can I take you there?
So there was a collection of shoes in the kitchen. Even mine were in there, y'all. So you know those had to go. Y'all, Bentley was having the time of his life with all of the crumbs that were on the floor. So now I'm just going in with a Clorox wipe to wipe down Christian's tablet and Caleb's high chair top.
So here is another look at how it looked before. And this is after. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.